Alright, hi everybody, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. Um, so we're gonna make our way to the next dungeon, which looks like it's in like the top left corner of the map. It's up in that forest up there. Um, I just have to remember how to get there. Ooh, gimme, gimme, come back. Gimme. Ugh, I got it. Okay. Oh, but then I got hit directly after. Dang it. Ah. Alright. Let's see. I gotta figure out how I'm... Okay. I kinda see it now. still hearts in here. Oh. The heck? Alright, let's see. I think if I... Do this real quick. There we go. Hearts. See, that works. Can I get any more? Oops. That's okay, though. Alright, back to it. Alright. Now I have to go... So I'm going to the top left, basically. So if I just keep heading in that direction, I should make it, maybe? I don't know. Because this doesn't look right. Nope, I have to go down. I have to go down and around, but that doesn't really make much sense. Oh yeah, it does. I see where I can go. Okay. Oh no, not the bees! Down and around. Oh. oh! That was interesting. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot about this little area here. What's in here in the dark world? Oh. After wandering into this world, I turned into this shape. I enjoyed playing the flute in the original world. There was a small grove where many animals gathered. I want to see that place again. I buried my flute there with some flower seeds. Will you try to find it for me? And I will lend you my shovel. Good luck. Okay. You borrowed a shovel. You can dig in many places. You'll never know what you'll find. Um, so then if I do the thing... And then he said he buried it here somewhere? I don't know. Honestly, you know what? I don't want to take up too much time doing extra stuff like that. I mean, I have the shovel now, so that's cool. I don't know how much I actually need that right now. Yay, hearts and such. Alright. I just kind of want to make my way to the dungeon and beat it. What's in here? Oh. 
No, I'm good. Oh, I don't think I can lift these yet. Nope. But then... But then how do I get up there if I can't... Maybe I can make my way around these ways? No? Oh, I can climb up that way. Hello. Welcome to the treasure field. The object is to dig as many holes as you can in 30 seconds. Any treasures you dig up will be yours to keep. It's only 80 rupees to play. No. Alright. I have no idea how I'm supposed to get to this darn dungeon. Because I can't lift these. Do I have to play this game? Well, hi, uh, howdy, Light Worlder. Light Worlder. You look like a straight shooter. Want to try your skill in my shooting gallery? I'll give you five shots for 20 rupees. If you're as sharp as I think you are, you stand to rake in the rupees. No, it's just... Alright, I'll be right back. Alright, so in order to get to the next dungeon, we had to go back into the light world using our um, mirror. Um, and now we're in the lost woods in the light world. And then, yeah, there's a little dark world warp right here. Oh. It's just like a dead Coloco, I guess. And this is going to be the... Yeah, I think this is the dungeon, like we're in the dungeon. Oh. Interesting. Unless, like, we still have to find the dungeon within here. I don't want to jump down holes yet, because, I mean, it starts hurting me. And there's still, like, overworld enemies, though, so I'm not sure if we're actually in the dungeon yet. Ooh, wait. Now it looks like we're in the dungeon. Okay. That's interesting. Um, okay, so I can't get over there. I don't think. Oh, there's a key door, but I don't have a key. Oh, so that just stuns them. Oh, careful. Oh, okay. Ooh, I got a map. That's cool. Um, ooh, this dungeon looks kind of big. Um, nothing to latch on to. Okay. Still no key. Dang, and I can't hit that button. Oh! Okay. That works. Ooh. All right, let's get all the items. Maybe one of them will be a key. Now it has nowhere to go, so it's just sitting there going in a circle. Let's bomb this wall, because that looks bombable. Yep. Let's see 
what's in here. Oh. Okay. Oh, but I can't. Oh, there we go. I was like, wait, I'm stuck. But I wasn't really stuck. Okay, so this is how I get to the big chest, but I need the big key first. Hmm. Did I maybe, like, enter the wrong way at first? I don't know. Maybe there's another entrance somewhere that I'm missing? Yeah, because it looks like these aren't really connected, though. Oh, that's because there's that locked door. So there must be another entrance somewhere that I haven't seen yet. So we did get a couple things in there. Oh. That wasn't cool. Oh. Where am I going to end up now? Oh. Well, that's great. Okay. Um. Yeah, I just gotta pretty much walk back. As long as I don't die on those darn spiky things. Oh, come on. Oh. Dead. Alright, I'll be right back once I get back over here. Alright, it looks like I found another entrance. So let's see what's in here. I don't remember what these guys are called. But they take a lot of hits to go down, let me tell you. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's fine. Just, you know, drop a random hand on me or whatever. Oh. Ow, and they do a lot of damage, too. Why can I move that? Is there... Okay, there is a button, but... I guess I'll need to pull it? Yeah, instead of pushing it. Get it into place this way. Oh, no. Now what? Oh, and it drops me back at the beginning. Jerk. Alright, let's go through here first. Let's see what is this way. Oh. Yeah, key. I need keys. What's out this way? Oh. Alright, more areas. I don't need any more rupees. What is this? It looks like it should be something, but... We're gonna keep going. Let's see what's... Yes! Yay, lots of hearts. Okay, now if I fall down here. Ooh, new area. Okay. Nope! Oh! Dang it. Okay. Interesting. Nope. Oh, okay. Now I can 
get down here. Oh, and this is back to this room. Okay. I guess that's fine. But now I have to figure this puzzle out. So, I know how to do it, I just have to basically keep moving so I don't get picked up by the hand thing. Set back to the beginning. Alright. So now, whoops. This needs to come all the way over here. It needs to get put back a little bit. So I can do that. Alright, now I should be able to just... Oh wait, but I need to pull it. I can't push it. So I need to be on this side of it. Oh! Come on! Oh, and it puts me all the way back here. It's not cool. Alright, let's do it again. So many hits. It takes eight hits to kill them. So I finally made it through to this room. Ooh, I, I got the big key. Sweet. Alright, it looks like there's a bomb hole right here. Those darn hands are really making me mad. They fall down and they pick you up and they put you back where you entered the dungeon. Alright, so now that I have the big key... Oh, it looks like I am, like, missing an area. Oh. But, I don't know if I can like, get there, is the thing. Because these don't move, there's nothing I can grapple onto, I don't think, over there. Oops. Um... Can I hook shot over there? No? Okay, I must have to come from the other way or something. So I'm gonna have to... go out and around, it seems. So, let's get out of here. And we wanna go to the right and down. If we can. Oh, I don't think that is the right place. Nope, this is right where I was. So, all right, I should be able to get through this fairly quickly. Let's go out this way, because I think, yeah, there is an exit here. should be easy to get back to the other area where we were, where we needed the big key. And I also have regular keys. Or one regular key. So I should be able to get into some more doors. So, regular key. These are mummy things. Really grinding my gears. And none of them really give me hearts either, which sucks. Can I hit you? I can hit you over this thing. Nope! Darn hand. Uh.
Now I gotta watch for the hand thing. Like it knows whenever I'm exploiting an easy way to hit these guys, and that's when it comes for me. of holes in the floor somehow. Alright, so basically it looks like I have to get to that top left section, and through there will be the boss and stuff, but it doesn't really show me how to get over there. Not exactly like a straight path over there. Alright, so let's keep looking around here. shot is like amazing for killing those enemies. <coughs> now what is this? I don't think it goes anywhere because there's, yeah, there's nowhere to go. So essentially there's nothing in this room. Wait for the fire. Let's go the other way. So we haven't been in this room either. Again. Oh, there's another key door right there, which basically leads up to where we've already been, but that's still pretty helpful. So let's go through. Oh, dang it. So, oh, dang it again. I need to get rid of this guy because he's freaking me out. guys. Now to see what's in the big chest. We found the fire rod. This rod commands the red fire, but watch your magic meter. Okay. Oh, okay. That's interesting. We can use that to attack, I guess. Well, maybe not everything. Dang it. Ah. All right, I'll be right back. Thank you. 
So this fire rod is actually really, really good. It's killing those guys that usually took eight hits, one hit to kill. They do kind of stick around for a second before they die, but still, like, there's another key, and there's only really one other door that I've seen so far that I haven't been able to open. And now I'm at full health, so that's helping me a lot. Um, hmm. So basically I have to leave and then go back through that other area. But wasn't that door like blocked off or something? Like I don't think I could actually get in there. Because it was passed away I couldn't get to. It's okay, we'll figure it out. Go out here. Cause just essentially I need to get to the points where I haven't been yet. Maybe it's like down one of the holes? If I jump down a hole? I need to be able to see the dungeon map. Because this is part of that area. Yeah, and now I need to go to the other side. There's a hole that drops me down in front of that door. There's also that thing right there, which I still don't really know what it is. Maybe the fire rod lets me get in there? Or something? Is the fire rod the key? It is! Alright. Okay, so this is the top left corner. Sweet. Why can't I... Oh, because that's not... Okay. I need... I'm gonna switch to the hookshot. Because the hookshot will kill kill these without using up my magic. Oh. And there's the door. I need to be careful here. So when I hit like the buttons, I don't know what's what it's gonna send me to. Oh! Dang it! Alright. Maybe if I... Okay. Oh! What the heck? Puzzles. Alright. Let's do the fire rod. Let's... What? What did that miss? Alright. Give me magic. Oh, and I can hit multiple. Okay. So. Oh, that does light them up. And it shoots a lot better than the than the little lantern thing. Oh. Right now I need the hook shot. I just have to wait for this to wear off. Except I just got grabbed. 
Okay. Man, I hate that. It's like the worst. Least favorite mechanic ever. Oh! Dang it. Oops. Careful. If I kill it, I don't think so. Well, I got a little bit more magic power, but that's not going to help me. Maybe if I use the lamp on most of them, and then I can use the fire rod on this one. Ah, uh, I don't have enough. How? How do I do things? Alright, I'll be right back once I get enough magic power to finish this out. Alright, I'm back, and I got the door open. Don't hit me. Alright, I need a book shot. Yeah. Gotta wait for this to wear off. Kill these things. So it sounded like something opened, and I'm guessing it must be behind one of these. Yep. Are there more though? Alright, so there's a hole back here. doing on the map. Okay, I should be getting pretty close to the end, actually. Oh, yep, and then I jump down there, and I bet you that's the boss. So whatever hand this goes to. Alright, down we go. Yep. Oh. Like, that seems to make sense. Oh, man, this is going to be hard. All right, I'll be right back. Whew! I finally won! All right, here we go. Finally beat it. <laughs> that took forever. But there was actually, like, I looked up a strategy for beating it. And with the magic hammer, if you can actually hit him, it you only need to hit him four times. So, Lando, because of you, I can escape from the clutches of the evil monsters. Thank you. Do you know the prophecy of the Great Cataclysm? This is the way I heard it. If a person who has an evil heart gets the Triforce, a hero is destined to appear, and he alone must face the person who began the Great Cataclysm. If the evil one destroys the hero, nothing can save the world from his wicked reign. Only a person 
of the Knights of Hyrule who protected the royalty of Hylia can become the hero. You are of their bloodline, aren't you? Then you must rescue Zelda without fail. Do you understand? Yes. May the way of the hero lead to the Triforce. Alright. Sweet. So that's it. And in the next episode, we'll go and do the next dungeon. So thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, share. Hit that bell so you get notified whenever I upload a new video. Check out my Patreon. Check out my music page. Follow me on Twitter. The link is down in the description. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!